So hello, hello. Welcome to the Full Moon in Sagittarius, the Manifesting Visionary Readings. This is secret code name High Speed Rail. All right, for those of you unfamiliar with how these work, they are purchased by individuals via my Etsy shop, okay? Once they purchase it, I let them know I got them and their secret code name is fill in the blank. All right, in this case, it is High Speed Rail. This is their personal reading. All right. However, the beauty of these events is that you may res resonate to one of the secret code names in divine time whenever it crosses your path, which means there's most likely a message in here for you. All right. For these readings today, I am using my Psychic Tarot of the Heart deck and my Wisdom of the Oracle cards to figure out what it is that you want to manifest, right, the vision, and then I'm using my new uh, descriptor deck, right, to figure out what the energy is. This is a custom deck that I created, okay, so you can't find it anywhere um, yet, <laughs> yet, and then I'm using my uh, Wild Unknown Tarot to see what that combination actually ends up looking like. And then I'm using my Universe Has Your Back deck as guidance on how to redirect your own energy um, to get it back to the vision that you actually wanna create, all right? And for those of you who follow me on Facebook, be reminded, I started a new page. It is called Energy 22 by Grace Nicole Myths. It's on Facebook for the strict purpose of announcing new items and services in my shop, uh, flash sales, and announcing the moon events like this, and the Divine Duality secret code name reading events, okay? I didn't want um, them pushing down my other posts on my regular page and, and vice versa, okay? So now everything that I offer, that I create, uh, will be on a its own page okay it'll be on its own page you can find it with the the at symbol all right energy 22 it's the same as my twitter account all right my new twitter so with that said <laughs> let's get into it secret code name high speed rail here we go all right so what is the vision what is the vision spirit secret code name high speed rail and those who would be drawn to the secret code name resonate to it in divine time what is the vision that you're manifesting from the outcome look like the actual manifestation Ooh. <laughs> it's interesting. The vision you want to manifest is not having to fucking think about shit. 
<laughs> and not having to constantly take the lead and be the dominating person. <laughs> okay. We've got refusing to see and take the lead and take the lead came out in the reverse. Um, I think you just want something very simple where you don't have to <laughs> plan anything. You don't have to see 10 steps ahead. You don't have to decide what's best. Like, I think that you, <laughs> you really want to divine feminine the fuck out of it and um, let your partner be someone that you can depend on right to take the lead I think that you're tired of being the leader possibly in, in multiple areas of your life right possibly in multiple areas of your life I, I think that you um, hmm, really want something much easier right you don't want to have to um, literally look at look ahead at every possible outcome every possible this every possible that it's just like you just want someone to say hey this is the plan you'd be like great that sounds fun and you do it <laughs> right allowing someone to um manifest into your life that's um more masculine right so that you don't have to be <laughs> Um, it came out clarified with a change in the wind, serendipity, co-create, and chop wood. Like, I think you just want simple. I think you really just want simple. Perfect place, perfect time. Someone you can partner with and co-create with, build with, who is in alignment with the same goals that you have, who wants the same things. And I definitely feel like you are ready mentally emotionally for the change right that you're even picturing the change itself okay i think this is what you're visualizing <laughs> visualizing something very easy all right now the energy that you're manifesting this vision from right we have shadow catalyst so you're probably dealing with a quote unquote partner or um, quote unquote twin flame that's actually a shadow catalyst, right? And you don't care anymore and or there is no feelings left, right? It's apathetic. Um, you're over this energy, right? Completely over this energy. You've let go of your own addictive behavior. Um, in regards to healing with this person, you've shown yourself self mercy, okay? And you are no longer negating your feelings um, in order to hold compassion for other people, right? Which is essentially self compassion. We got two crown chakra cards there, all right? You're unwilling to be your own detriment. Unwilling to be your own detriment. Okay, I think you're manifesting from the place of knowing um, you don't want to be apathetic like this or not, e not even care. Or you might be dealing with a person, a shadow catalyst who is apathetic, doesn't care if they live or die, like doesn't fucking, you know what I mean? And, and you're just, you're over this situation, right? You're over this situation. So if that's what you want to manifest, and this is the energy that you are manifesting from, um, the actual outcome is really good. <laughs> okay. We get the lover's card clarified by the ace of pentacles. So you are absolutely manifesting someone new, <laughs> absolutely manifesting a new solid foundation um, with someone who is a father of cups energy and kind of completes the cycle, right? So whatever the shadow catalyst was for you, whoever they were for you or whatever it was for you, um, on the other side of that completed karma, right? Whatever the karmic cycle you had between you and them in this life that needed to close. Uh, once it closed, you allowed your black swan to come forward. Now, black swans are extremely rare individuals, right? They are 
what is essentially our divine mirror of the healed self, okay? They are the people that kind of catch our soul in, in a mesmerizing type way where it's almost like, thank God I met you, like, you're who I've been looking for my whole life. This is someone who is very emotionally mature. All right, this is someone who um, King Energy knows how to manifest from a very considerate place, right? It's almost like when you showed yourself mercy and you showed yourself compassion, that's what manifested for you in the outer experience, someone who is like a gift of mercy to you, who is very compassionate and considerate of you. Um, this is someone who truly does share your vision. Like I, like the king, I feel like they like taking the lead, right? They like taking the lead um, and you trust them to take the lead right because you could trust their emotional state is is mature this is not a, they're not a petty person right this is not a knight this is someone who's very mature so with that said <laughs> that's awesome with that said this is your guidance all right from the universe has your back deck it says i create mindful moments throughout the day reminding myself that i am love and miracles are natural so continue to believe in that beautiful energy right secret code name high speed rail whether you realize it or not i think you got on the fast track <laughs> got on the fast track when you let go of all of that shadow stuff right this this shadow energy really pushed you to define what it is that you really want and once you understood what you really wanted um the universe said okay and let their wish be granted <laughs> so um congratulations in advance <laughs> Because you've definitely um, healed, right? You've definitely healed quite a bit. And moving forward, you're manifesting some beautiful things. So um, I look forward to reading for you more in the future. This is great stuff. <laughs> this is great stuff. So until next time, guys, all of my information is in the description below. Drop a like if you haven't already. Leave me a comment. Let me know how it resonated, especially if you caught it in divine time. And I will see you next time. Take care.